Megan for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. Android Studio Arctic Fox is now available to download in the stable release channel. This latest release brings to life Jetpack Compose 1.0, Android's new toolkit for building native UI. The release also focuses on devices, including Wear OS, and helps with developer productivity with features like a new background task manager. We used your feedback to create this suite of new Android Studio features that will help empower the developer community to create high quality, modern apps across devices faster. To see the full list of changes, view the Android Studio Arctic Fox beta release blog and release notes, and check out the post for more details. Mark your calendars. Registration is now open for Google Cloud Next on October 12th through 14th, 2021. We designed Next21 as a customizable digital adventure to allow for a more personalized journey. You'll be able to participate in online interactive experiences and attend on-demand sessions. This year, we've made Google Cloud Next free to make the experience inclusive and accessible to everyone. To learn more, check out the post. Firebase has released brand new beta libraries that are significantly smaller in size. Some are even up to 80% smaller. We've managed to reduce the size all without removing any features from the previous version. This is made possible by converting our library to take advantage of code elimination features of modern day JavaScript tools like Webpack and Rollup. To learn more about the new library, watch the Google I.O. talk or check out our upgrade guide for more in-depth information about the upgrade process, which will all be in the post. And in the cloud, we're excited to announce that you can take advantage of serverless build environments within your own private network with new Cloud Build private pools. Cloud Build offers on-demand auto-scaling capabilities and active build minute billing, all with no infrastructure to manage. Private pools also unlock a host of new customization options, such as new machine types, higher maximum concurrency, regional builds, and network configuration options. To get started, try the quick start or read the overview documentation for more details, including what Cloud Build now supports. All the information will be available in the post. If you're looking for the latest news on the developers and startups ecosystem in India, look no further. Catch Anuj on the latest news show from India, where he discusses supporting COVID-19 community projects and more. While you're there, be sure to subscribe to the Google Developers India YouTube channel and stay tuned for future episodes. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'm Megan for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. Okay, now you're a kid who is speaking down to try to see Santa Claus.